We've had so many great experiences. It's been unbelievable so far. Join us on Positive World Travel. Because there's so many ruins here and they're all quite spread out all over the place around Hampi, we decided that we're going to hire a motorbike for the day so we can get around and see as many as we want to. The stonework and carvings on these ruins are extremely detailed, many depicting various gods and goddesses. One of the most famous ruins is a stone chariot, where soldiers, hunters and Persians are depicted all around this giant stone structure. It's an extremely hot day here in Hampi and we're walking around the spectacular ruins. As you can see, everywhere you walk, there's a ruin here, there and everywhere. And it'd be amazing to think what it'd be like if we step back in time when the kings were around here. Each ruin you visit shows something different and unique, all giving us a glimpse into the once royal lifestyles. A very impressive building is the Elephant Stable, which used to house the royal elephants. This here is the Lotus Mahal and it's been quite well preserved and it's thought to have been um, used for festivals and also performances. And there's also an um, underground cellar nearby which is said to have been where the people used to discuss state secrets. Surrounding these great ruins is this magnificent backdrop and just behind me is the main tower that stands 11 storeys tall. The surrounding countryside is just as spectacular as the ruins themselves and is a place where time seems to stand still. Stay here exploring this relaxing town and you'll be sure to get much more out of it. I really need it. Action! Ew.